Hi everyone, this is a review on the Hit Light 10 Watt Floodlight. Now it's a color changing light, which we're going to see, and uh, it's mountable. You can see right here you have the ability to mount it, and it's waterproof. So uh, it is a uh, kind of a neat thing you can either have outside, you can mount it for um, for effects for for um, for pictures inside, or even for like Halloween and Christmas. So it has quite a few cool little features to it, and it has this remote control, and this is pretty common remote control for any kind of uh, color changing LED light. So let's look at it and we're going to see how this thing works and 10 watts is actually pretty bright. It says it's a 40 watt equivalent but I actually think it's probably a little bit more than that. So um, we're going to look at it uh, just against a wall in the dark and then we're actually going to compare it or we're going to shine it on a picture just to show you how you can get some kind of a mooding or mood effect to a picture. So uh, with that, let's uh, see how it works. Okay, uh, first thing is I can't actually show you how bright it is because it's going to wash out the camera pretty badly. But here you can see on the wall um, what it looks like from, this is just the white. Uh, we'll switch it to red, green, blue. Okay, so this is the white light. Now I can't show you exactly what it looks like straight on because it will completely wash out the camera but you can see it's white now we can we can rotate through some of the colors here so let me pull the remote out in front of it go to yellow red blue purple and even green here so you can see you get a lot of you actually get pretty bright light now let's look at a picture that we have now I'm going to do it from an angle because the cord actually isn't long enough for me to fully um, set it up right in front of it. So there's the green. So again, you can get different effects here. So we'll turn it to red, green, blue. And again, if you adjusted it correctly, it will bring out the different contrast in the picture itself. So we can go to purple. And now you can start to see that it does have some differences to it. So that's one of the ways that you can use it to uh, for an accent piece in, in, in artwork or just for uh, for uh, other features in your home. Okay, a few more thoughts on the uh, light here. It does have different modes. So you have like a flash mode where it changes colors. You have a strobe mode, I assume in white. You have a uh, fade where it fades from color to color. We'll see that here in a second. And then a uh, kind of a smooth transition. And of course you have regular brightness. Now this remote works from 25, 30, 35 feet away. I've had pretty good luck with it. Um, and uh, everybody kind of has a, uh, um, a different idea for what we can use the light for. My wife's a teacher. She would like to put it in her classroom. My daughter would love to have it in her bedroom. And then uh, for myself, uh, I think it would be fun to have in front of the house, if nothing else, for Halloween or for Christmas. So I'm going to give it four and a half stars. There really isn't anything I don't like about it. I uh, maybe wish that the cord was a little longer than what it is, but uh, at this price point, you really are going to have a hard time finding a better LED floodlight than this. So um, it's a great value, and uh, it definitely is something you should take a look at if you're interested in a color-changing floodlight.